Good morning children. Welcome back to the social science class. In the last class, we had learned about the important tourist places of Delhi. Children, today we will learn about the important religious places and the important festivals of Delhi. Okay. Delhi has some well-known religious places that attract Indians as well as the tourists all over the world. Delhi has some well-known religious places that attract Indians as well as the tourists all over the world. The Birla Mantar, Gurudwara Bankla Sahib, Jama Masjid, St. James Church, Lotus Temple and Akshardham Temple further add the beauty of the beauty to the capital city. The Birla Mantar, Gurudwara, Bankla Sahib, Jama Masjid, St. James Church, Lotus Temple and Akshardham Temple further add to the beauty of the capital. Delhi has many stadiums like Jawaharlal Nehru Stadium, Indira Gandhi Stadium and Talkatora Stadium. Delhi has many stadiums like Indira Gandhi Stadium, Jawaharlal Nehru Stadium and Talkatora Stadium. Important sporting events are held here. Important sporting events are held here. The city of Delhi successfully hosted the Commonwealth Games in 2010. The city of Delhi successfully hosted the Commonwealth Games in 2010. So children, which are the important religious places of Delhi? The Birla Mantar, Gurudwara Bankla Sahib, Jama Masjid, St. James Church, Lotus Temple and Akshara Akshartham Temple are the important religious places of Delhi. Which are the important stadiums of Delhi? Delhi has many stadiums like Jawaharlal Nehru Stadium, Indira Gandhi Stadium and Talkatora Stadium and Talkatora Stadium. Okay. Well developed modern bridges, roads and flyovers have made, made Delhi a modern and comfortable city to live in. Well developed modern roads, bridges and flyovers have made Delhi, made Delhi a modern and comfortable city to live in. Delhi Metro provide, Delhi Metro provide a fast and cheap means of transport to the people. Delhi Metro provide a fast and cheap means of transport to the people. In Delhi, all festivals like Holi, Diwali, Eid, Dasara, Navros, Easter, Christmas, Guru Pura, Pongal, and Makar Sankranti are celebrated with joy. In Delhi, all festivals like Holi, Diwali, Eid, Dasara, Navaros, Easter, Christmas, Guru Pura, Pongal and Makar Sankranti are celebrated with a joy. Men normally wear trousers and 
shirts women wear sari salwar kameez and the western dresses men normally wear trousers and shirts women wear sari salwar kameez and modern or the western dresses in delhi you meet people from different states as they come here to seek job opportunities and education they come here to seek job opportunities and their education as a research we come across many cultures of different states of india as a result we come across many cultures of different states of india come across different states of india we speak they speak a different they speak different types of languages and celebrate different types of festivals but they love this lively city they love this lively city therefore the delhi is called a mini india therefore delhi is called a mini india why the delhi is called a mini india because in delhi you meet people from different states and they seek for what purpose they come here huh they come here to seek job opportunities and education they come here to seek job opportunities and education as a result we come across many cultures of different states of india they speak different languages and celebrate different festivals but they love this lively city so therefore the delhi is called a mini india therefore delhi is called a mini india children these are the important topics from this lesson delhi children you have to read the textbook properly you you will get your notes through whatsapp Okay children now i am winding up in this class thank you have a nice day